This week in Destiny. Emotional damage! Um... <laughs> I, 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 this is completely unscripted. I don't even know where to begin. First of all, let me just say, Bungie, you guys are, are crazy good. Like, the narrative team have done exceptional, exceptional, exceptional work. Um, this, this is a heavy week. I started typing a lore video, or I started scripting a video, and I said to myself, you know what, I'm just going to be really open and honest about my thoughts in terms of what happened uh, this week. Zavala, sorry, Zavala's over there, and I'm like... I feel like this 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 image, right? This pic this video of Zavala sums up pretty much um everything, right? I'm not going to spoil what happened this week, but I want to talk about Zavala as a character and I'm genuinely it's just been a long time since I've 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 watched or experienced anything that genuinely has me so uh so deep in thought, right? There's just so many things that were dealt with here. Um, how I approach this without like giving things away uh, is going to be quite difficult, but I'll do my best to make sense of it. So this week in Destiny, a lot happened with Zavala. I won't go into too much detail, uh, but the Bungie D team nailed this. They always nail this with every story. They did this with Crow. I was gonna do a video on Crow, but it was so like, it was it was really difficult to to put words together, right? Like I'm, I'm, I'm this season, probably why I've been so slow with lore video is is the fact that it's just been really difficult for me to articulate, um, articulate this. Uh, grief has definitely been an overarching theme in this season, and dealing with this and dealing with regret, and dealing uh, in imposter syndrome, big time, big time. I did a Twitter space yesterday, and uh, I was talking about imposter syndrome, and uh, as a creative, and like, I have no doubt about this, that for every team member of Bungie that worked on this, Every single one of those people would have struggled with that at some point along the way. Feeling like they're unqualified, feeling like the story that they've created isn't worth anything. Uh, whether it's going to be received well from the community or not, are people going to notice or are they, they, or are they just going to run past it? So, um, I think what I'd like to do is obviously do this little quick video, but then do like a maybe like a season of the haunted montage i did this really early on back when locations were being vaulted obviously now mars has returned but um sorry obviously now mars has returned but i really wanted to uh that was an easy way for me to sum up how i felt about everything that's happened in season of the haunted so far so i i think i would like to do one of those Except this time I'll probably throw like a really nice lo-fi track underneath it uh, to keep it positive and uh, to just highlight the work that the team have done. Very often it's easy I think to just create lore videos for you guys and be like hey let me drop my own narrative and how all the connective threads fit together but I think that this to honor Season of the Haunted I'm just gonna do a montage of like all the different places that I have captured scenes from and uh, yeah put some music underneath that and maybe just engage in conversation in a different way so if you have any like questions comments or thoughts about things happening in this season drop them in the uh, comment section down below and let me know how you feel about this season I think I've more or less given a good good example <laughs> of how I felt this season um yeah I think I think I'm gonna leave it there so remember that no matter what you're going through at this time you can do all things stay safe 
and Godspeed.